Hey folks, I'm going to do a really quick video here. Um, so for 75 Hard, I've been reading, reading Good to Great by Jim Collins. And uh, he has a chapter where he talks about the hedgehog concept, which is essentially you want to do something that you love to do or that you're passionate about. You want to do something you can be best in the world at and that uh, drive what drives your economic engine are the three things that he asks you to consider. And what's interesting is is that um, I looked at it and I think I'm close to it um, with the podcasts, with the um, sponsorships drive the economic engine, but I, I felt like there was something missing and I'm still trying to figure that out. Um, I, I think there's something there. He tells you to look at profit per something and um, I... I, I kind of wanted to say profit per podcast episode, um, mainly because the driver behind that is going to be something like, um, uh, let's see, you know, just uh, putting out great episodes so that people uh, trust us and then um, providing them terrific value by having sponsors that will actually, you know, help them out. You know, they provide... Um, solutions to their problems. And that's kind of the way that we've already done things. Um, I, I think codifying it and then just, um, you know, rel relentlessly pursuing that um, is what makes the most sense. And honestly, maximizing the profit per uh, podcast episode, essentially, there are three elements to it. And, and I'm kind of formulating this in my head as I speak. Um, I've, I've been thinking a little bit about it, but I've been kind of working on some other stuff too. So, um, anyway, I'm going to keep this to five minutes regardless. And, uh, yeah, I wish I could do this live, but yeah, the, the Wi-Fi here has been awful. So I'm recording it on my phone and then I can just upload as it gets bandwidth. Um, uh, but yeah, so essentially the, the elements to this are, uh, the size of the audience plays a role because, uh, the, the amount of exposure then drives the return on investment that the, the sponsors get, and that's what essentially drives what they're willing to invest, right? So if they invest $1,000 and they get $5,000 worth of sales back, then that's a win for them. Or if they, you know, if they're looking for a certain amount of awareness, right? And so then generally they're looking at the exposure that they get. And so if there are 10,000 or 20,000 podcast listeners for the podcast, then that translates for them. But I, I also want to make sure that they're high quality sponsors because then people are willing to go check them out. Um, and I don't really want to peddle anything that I don't believe in. So, uh, you know, there are some elements of that that kind of come into play with it. Um, I'm not sure if that's the right proxy for what we're trying to do. I think it's a good start. Um, I also considered profit per podcast listener, um, and that kind of drives us a little bit more toward the products and a little bit less toward the sponsorships, which is an interesting option as well. And there are certain products that I want to put together. Um, the, the other area, though, is that, you know, what can we be the best in the world at? Um, and, I mean, programming podcasts, I think I think we're kind of, uh, we're, we're close if we're not there, right? Um, there are definitely things we can do better. Um, but I feel like uh, in a lot of ways we could be there. But the podcasts in and of themselves, you know, I, I, guess, I guess if you go back to the idea of being the best in the world, though, then being the best in the world is um, putting together the podcasts that are going to have the highest impact on the listener, right? As opposed to, you know, putting out a gazillion podcasts and it has to be sustainable. So they have to be good shows, which, you know, meets with what I want to do anyway. Um, so, so I'm still, still trying to figure that out. Um, I'd love to know what you think if you watch this and, uh, what your feel is. Um, like I said, I feel like the first one, what, what we can be the best in the world at, um, I think the podcast is right in line with that. Um, I think the economic drivers for the sponsorships and or products um, is, is a pretty easy direction to figure out one way or the other. And so then it's just a matter of, yeah, maximizing that, that third thing, whatever it is. 
Anyway, we're at five minutes, so I'm going to wrap. Bye.